Hi guys, it's Marty here from letsbuildwp.com and in this video we're going to be covering how to delete a WordPress website that's being hosted on Bluehost. Just be sure to make a backup of your website before you do this if you think there's even the slightest chance you might regret it. Because once it's gone, there won't be any way to get it back. Then as long as you're sure you want to delete your WordPress site, this is what we need to do. After logging into our Bluehost account, we're going to click into WordPress hosting on the left. And here we'll see a list of any websites we have hosted on our account. If we have more than one website, we'll need to make sure we choose the right one. Then over on the right, we're going to click manage. And this will open up the main options for this website. Now under site information in the middle, we just want to double check it's showing the correct domain. Then as long as this is the website we want to delete, above this on the right, we can click into settings. Then scroll down to the bottom of this page and click delete site on the right. That's going to open up this pop-up and we'll see here that it says this action cannot be undone. By deleting the website, you will remove all content, backups and database information. So basically it's going to be completely deleted. Then as long as we agree to this, we just need to type our domain name as it appears in red into this box underneath and then click delete. And once our website's been deleted, we'll be brought back to this page. Then if we want to install WordPress again, we just need to click add site on the right. Make sure install WordPress is selected on this screen and click continue and Bluehost will guide us through the rest of the steps. So that's us now at the end, and that was how to delete a WordPress website on Bluehost. Please give the video a like here on YouTube if you find it helpful, and consider subscribing to the channel for more Bluehost and WordPress tutorials in future. Once again, my name's Marty from letsbuildwp.com, and thank you very much for watching.